Unraveling the Moral Law, an essential guide for English learners. Hello, dear viewers. Today, we're diving into a fascinating phrase that you might come across in literature, philosophical discussions, or even everyday conversations. We're going to explore the meaning of moral law. If you've ever pondered about right and wrong, or the rules of good conduct, then you're in the right place. Let's unravel the layers of moral law together. Moral law is a term that you might hear in various contexts, but at its core, it represents a set of universal principles that govern ethics and morality. These are not written laws like those in a legal book but are often felt internally, guiding a person's actions towards what is considered righteous and just. Imagine it as an invisible compass within each person, pointing them towards actions that are morally good. It's what tells you, deep down, that helping someone in need is the right thing to do, or that stealing is wrong, regardless of what the laws of the land may say. The concept of moral law has roots that go deep into human history, philosophy, and religion. For instance, in Christian theology, moral law is considered to be set by God, inherently known by all, and reflective of his character. In philosophy, thinkers like Immanuel Kant have discussed moral law as the principles that one must follow to be rational and virtuous. It's important to note that while moral laws are thought to be universal, the interpretation of what actions are moral can vary widely across different cultures and personal beliefs. In today's world, moral law often comes up in debates about human rights, justice, and personal integrity. It's the inner voice that urges individuals and societies to strive for fairness, equality, and goodness, beyond the minimum of what legal laws require. When we speak of someone having a strong moral compass, we are referring to their consistent alignment with these moral laws, displaying traits like honesty, compassion, and responsibility. For English learners, understanding the phrase, moral law, is not just about adding to your vocabulary. It's also about grasping a concept that is key to engaging in deep discussions about ethics, character, and philosophy. It helps in understanding English literature and texts that deal with complex human experiences and the eternal question of, what is the right thing to do? Thank you for joining me on this exploration of moral law. I hope this video has shed some light on this profound concept and enriched your understanding of English expressions related to morality and ethics. Stay curious, and may your moral compass always guide you well. See you in our next video.